Welcome back to you, you, yo. Do you, uh, uh, GX Academy, the fail, fail, it, it, intro. What is up, guys? Floodmon14 here, and I'm recording my, like, fourth episode in a row of this. Let's do it. Yeah, having fun. I miss GX Duel Academy, man, and it's just nice seeing different characters and stuff. I'm dueling Flyery Duelists. I totally gotta get in sight. Yeah, let's do it again. Rematch. I'm gonna pay you back for not letting me play Master of Laws last duel. Let's do it. That's not licious. <laughs> All right, Jim. Round two. Round two. Fight. Over. Get over here. All right, smashing round. First turn. Legendary Ocean. Like to see it. Ah. Uh... His monsters aren't too strong. Mm, I might regret this, but I'm actually not gonna play Legendary Ocean first turn. I'm gonna see if he plays his field card and then try to knock it out. His uh, fusion gate or whatever. After I win, I'm gonna celebrate with grilled cheese sandwiches. Ah, that's it? Okay. All right, well, I'll go ahead and play a Legendary Ocean then. Not a problem, Bastion. Legendary Ocean, go! Yeah. Now we'll be dueling underwater. And that's not all. Now I equip Big Bang Shot to my giant red sea snake. This will give my monster piercing and 400 more points. Uh, and he won't be able to get over that easily. I probably should set widespread ruin, but I'm not going to. Down goes your just walk. Ooh, 2100. Man, that's some good damage. All right. All right, Chumley, I end my turn. That's good enough. Let's see what you've got. It's time to rock this pot of greed. That's a good one. He's probably going to get something good here. Mm, okay, okay. Getting back his wand back. What else? Ah, uh, you would, man. Delicious. I will attack with this Death Kangaroo. Ooh, this turn's going to hurt. Delicious. I gotcha. Man. He went all out. Well, that pot of greed definitely helped him. Definitely. 3,100 more. Well, just like last time, we're going to have to get through Snatch Steel, guys. That's... Whew, Snatch Steel is just a really good card. All right, luckily we got Graceful Charity here. So... Now, I do have Smashing Round. Smashing Round will take out... At least take out Death Kangaroo, which I might want to do. Because it's a fusion piece, and we definitely don't want him to fuse. Alright, so Graceful Charity, draw three, discard two. Hmm. Let's see. Well, don't really need terraforming. Already got our field card. And I guess we'll discard. Hmm. Maybe I will discard Smashing Ground. Because I think Metal Morph will help us more here. Now, let's discard Smashing Round. I don't want to, but let's do it. Decide. All right. Ooh. Bit of an advanced move for you here. Check this out, Chumley. I summon Mama Grizzly in attack mode. Now I'll set two face downs. And like I said, a little more of an advanced move. Now, Mama Grizzly, attack Just Wombat. And since they both have the same points, they'll both be destroyed. Yes, but my Mama Grizzly has a special effect. Now I can special summon another Mama Grizzly from my deck. Or any other water monster I want. I'll play another Mama Grizzly. Attack mode. Nice. All right, Mama Grizzly number two, destroy his death kangaroo. Oh, that rhyme, heck yeah. All right, we do have widespread ruin. Let's see. Hmm. Should I play swords? Hmm. You know what? Nah, we're not gonna play swords. We're not gonna play swords. I think we can do this. What do you got, chum? Delicious! I summon Death Kangaroo! Hmm. That's it? Alright, good. We made the right decision then. I'll attack Mother Grizzly with my giant red sea snake. Oh, no, you won't. No, you won't. That's my giant red sea snake. And I won't let him betray his former master. Go, widespread ruin. This destroys the monster with the highest attack. Uh-huh. And now your kangaroo cannot attack. 
Ah, two face downs, okay. I see those face downs, chum. I, ooh, Daedalus. Man. Uh, hmm. Well, it is risky, but this would definitely turn the duel around. All right, guys, I had to go for it. It's it's like the signature play of this deck. Levi, Dragon Daedalus. Uh, <gasps> he didn't trap holes, guys. All right. Now, Chumley, I use the Fire Trap and Daedalus Special Effect. By sending Umi to the graveyard, all the cards on the field are washed away. Goodbye. <laughs> Let's see what we destroy. Magic Jammer, seven tools, good, and your Death Kangaroo. Bye bye. All right. And that's not all, Chumley. For now, I will banish two water monsters. Red Sea Snake and Mama Grizzly. Decide. I send my monsters to the banish zone to special summon Fenrir. All right, Fenrir, go. Ghost Fang Venom. Winning a duel, we're winning a duel. Go, Leviathan Dragon Daedalus, legendary tsunami. Oh, man. Yeah, you should have stayed bit. And he already wasted a snatch deal, so I feel pretty good about this. I feel pretty good. Yeah. All right, we got Rush Frequency. That's really good, actually. So what I'm actually going to do, I'm going to throw Fenrir in first. And so no matter what, we're going to skip his draw phase next turn. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Kangaroo Champ, huh? Interesting. All right. Let's finish him off. Go, Fenrir. Ghost Fang Venom effects. Now, Leviathan Dragon Daedalus, attack his life points. And to get more points, I activate Rush Recklessly in the damage step. Go, boost my Leviathan Dragon's legendary tsunami attack. Totally bogus. Game over. 490, nice, nice. All right, pretty good. Either way, I'm not upset. Dueling's not all about winning, you know? Yeah, next duel by mail, Jay Nugi. Let's do it. Hey, glad you showed up. Let's do this. I've been waiting for this duel a long time. Get your game on. All right, looks like Jaden will probably be going first. What? No, he let us go first? Well, thanks, Jaden. You're, you're a good guy. You're a good guy, Jaden. Duel. Oh, Slate Warrior. Yeah, this is a new card we got last episode. And I went ahead and put it in this deck. It is pretty good. Check this out. So slight warrior. It's a flip effect monster. Increase the attack and defense of this monster by 500. Also, if you just normal summon it and it's destroyed in battle, uh, yeah, whatever kills this will lose 500 points. So that's very good. Very, very good. I think we'll set scapegoat first turn. And um, I forget how the AI works in this game. You know what? Let's test something here. I'm actually going to set Slate Warrior. And then I'm going to see if the AI attacks our scapegoats. Get your game on. It's my turn, so I draw. All right. Yeah, yeah. Let's, uh... Well, let's wait till he attacks. Let's wait till he attacks. Let's wait till he attacks. What do you got, Jay? I'm going to summon Burst Inatrix in attack mode. All right. Battle phase time. Check out this preload card. Skyscraper. All right. Battle phase. Okay, okay. Now let's chain scapegoat to the attack. Let's see if he attacks either the scapegoats or the face down. Because I forget how the AI works. Oh, okay, he did go for the face down. Okay, okay. Thought I could get away with flip summoning uh, Slate Warrior there, but no. Okay, that's fine. You're up. All right, Jaden, let's do it. All right. So let's go with... Now, I do have Dark Factory, so I'm going to summon Red Sea Snake and attack... No. Okay. As long as that's not Torrential there, Jaden, I'll be okay. Uh, just in case he card destructions, I'll set Dark Factory. All right. Your move, Jaden. Your move. I'm going to summon Avion in attack mode. Now, go, my first... Dinatrix, go! Use your burst fire attack to burn away the villainy! <laughs> now, Avion, attack! Feather break! Not bad, Jaden. Not bad. 
All right, it's our turn now. Let's see if we can get rid of some of his fusion material pieces. I'll summon Amphibious Bugroth in K3. And I know he has Skyscraper, but I want to get rid of his fusion parts. So we'll attack Mercedes. Send him to the graveyard. 800 damage. Take that, Gene. I end my turn. And if he doesn't have any traps next turn, we can attack over Avion. Uh-oh. That's not what I thought he'd do. Cybertech Alligator. Sorry, Flood. My Cybertech Alligator is going to attack your amphibious bug rock. It's going to be sweet. Looks like I got my game on. Ooh, smart move, Jaden. Smart move. Ah, but we did get Umi Ruka, which is nice. Uh, let's go ahead and play it. Just to knock out Skyscraper. Now I activate Umi Ruka, Jaden. And let's see. Don't think I can play either of these yet. But I'll set Aquamador. And we will end our turn once more. Ha ho, that rhymed. I'm gonna summon Bubble Man in attack mode. Oh, now you play a water monster. Now you play one, now that I got Umi Ruka out. Eh, heh. Looks like you attacked in the wrong order, Chiden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not a problem. All right. Ooh, Kotetsu. Okay. I was thinking I was going to play Fenrir here and make him not be able to draw. This actually changes my mind a bit. So instead, I'm going to activate Dark Factory at Mass Production now while there's no Magic Jammer. Let's take back, yeah, Sea Snake and Aquamador. Decide. All right. Uh -huh. And let's set Katetsu. So I'll probably take a power-up card. Like, I think I have, like, Black Pennant, Malevolent Nuzzle, or something like that. Uh, so we should be good. Sparkman. Ha! I summon Sparkman. Everyone knows that water monsters are weak against electricity. Huh. Interesting decision. Mage power on Bubble Man. And all you have is one face, one spell or trap, so not too worried about that. Yeah, we'll take, uh, let's take Black Pinnit. That should be enough to get over Cybertech Alligator there. All right, so he's going to clear our field here. Hopefully he just doesn't play any face downs. You're up. Good. My turn, Jaden. Ooh, good card. What's all in the graveyard here? And we got Slate Warrior and Amphibious Bugroth. Hmm, so if I revive Slate Warrior, it can actually get over Bubble Man. Sounds good to me, Jaden. I played Premature Burial. Now I pay 800 points to revive a monster you destroyed earlier this duel. Slate Warrior returns to the field. But that's not all, Jay. Check this out. Giant Red Sea Snake. I summon it. And now I'll play Black Pendant, the equip card I searched last turn, on my Sea Snake. This will boost it to 2,800 points. Go, my Giant Red Sea Snake. Ha! Everyone knows machine monsters are weak against water. Flood and rust his monster out with a surf attack. <laughs> now, go, my Slate Warrior. Attack his bubble man now! Air cutter slice! There we go. Now we're back in control of this duel. I am my turn, Gene. Nice. What you got now, son? Check out this primo card. Card destruction. Hmm. He might draw something good here. Let's see. Oh, no spells and traps. That's what oh oh. I see that face down, Jane. You said at the last second. Okay. Hmm, well, we got Graceful Charity. Let's... Well, he doesn't have any cards in his hand, so I don't know if it's Magic Jammer. Let's see what we get here. All right. Ooh, Sinister Serpent. Definitely going to discard that. I guess we'll also discard Seven Colored Fish. No, I'll discard Daedalus, because I don't have the uh, Legendary Ocean on the field. I have Umi Ruka, so... Right now, Daedalus is not as good. Uh, yeah, decide. There we go. Decide. All right. So, hmm. Maybe I should just attack first and summon in my main phase two. Uh, yeah, 
Yeah, just in case it's Mirror Force. That sounds like a good idea. All right, Slate Warrior. Get rid of that spark, man. We can't have electric monsters using their special power to destroy water monsters. And is he going to play a trap on this? Sea Snake attack? Oh, we're good. We're good. Okay. So the only thing I haven't done is play a trap or summon. So, uh, yeah, let's set Magician of Faith. And I will end my turn there, Jay. Take back Graceful Charity probably next turn. We're winning the duel. We're winning the duel. Two face downs. Mm. All right. Take back Sinister Serpents. I flip summon Magician of Faith. And the spell card I'll take back is, of course, Graceful Charity. Yes. Now I once again activate Graceful Charity. You know how it works, Jaden. I draw three and discard two. All right, so let's discard Sinister Serpent, of course. And what else shall we discard? Um, oh, we got Seven Tools and Trap Jammer. Oh, good, good, okay. I'm actually gonna discard Sinister, I mean, Giant Red Sea Snake here, this side. And believe it or not, I'm actually not gonna attack, guys. I've got three monsters in attack mode. Has he played Mirror Force or discarded it? Let's see. Let's see, because he did play Card Destruction, so I want to check. Okay, no Mirror Force, so I'm actually not going to attack this turn, just in case. I don't want to lose all three of my monsters. What do you got, Jay? Nothing. Perfect, 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 perfect. All right, with Sinister Serpent, I'll return it to my hand. Ooh, and we got Oi. Perfect. All right. So let's summon something good here. Now I summon Gagagio. No traps, huh? I smell a mirror force. Do you guys? Let's do it. Magician of Faith, attack him directly. Saint Staff Magic attack. Negate attack. Negate attack actually negates the attack and ends the battle phase. Ha. It would if I didn't have Trap Jimmer, Jaden. Check this out. Yeah. What you got? What you got? You got nothing, son. Go! Saint Staff Magic Blast! Now, let's see what else you got face down. Slate Warrior Air Cutter Slice! Ah, nothing! Nothing! Wow, I'm kind of surprised. Alright! Ah! This duel isn't over yet! Ho ho ho! But it is, Jaden! And you are powerless! Garagigo! Sharp Claw Slice! Nice move! Game over! Alright, and 526, pretty good. Yeah, we destroyed five monsters in the battle there. Don't, I lost. Okay, Homer. Thanks, Fiery Duelist. Let's do it again sometime. Yeah, Fiery Duelist sounds so much cooler. Where should I go today? Ooh, new mail. You have mail. Let's see what this is. It's almost New Year's Day. I've got to make a grilled cheese to celebrate and a New Year's resolution. I promise to give up grilled cheese sandwiches. <gasps> oh, forget it. I love them too much. <laughs> okay, Chimley. So, not sure why we got that mail, but all right. Now, it is Saturday, and we did get a, a bit more duelist points. So, let's head to see Sadie, because I remember that the uh, packs on the weekends are different. All right, yeah, yeah, Residents of the Sea. Now, we want to buy some more of this, because if I remember right, uh, Mobius the Frost Martyr comes in this bag. Yeah. Uh, live vehicles. I don't remember if this one's good or not. Also, let's see if there's any new packs here. Uh, we want a couple of these. Try to get seven tools. Uh, a couple of these. They're only a hundred. A couple of these. Uh, a couple of these, I guess. Um... Let's see. I think we've seen all these packs before. Um, I don't really have to have too many pyro cards, but I'll buy... I'll buy three pyros, and I guess we'll buy one more Residence of the Sea. So I would definitely like another Mobius the Frost Monarch. All right, guys, wish me luck. Let's see what we get. All right, Big Bang Shoot. Big Bang Shot. <gasps> United We Stand. Did we have that already? I don't know. That might be our first one. That's a pretty good equip card, either way. Raijiki. Nice. All right, what do we get out of this? We're still looking for, like, Pot of Greed and stuff. 
That's why I'm buying these spell collections. Plus, they're, they're cheap. I mean, 100, that's not too much, honestly. Same for the, looking for the other seven tools. And honest, honestly, I would recommend uh, three seven tools if you can manage to get them, because, and all the trap cards, amphibian beasts, that's cool. Uh, salvage, good. Can we get the Mobius? I think it was like an ultra rare though, so might be kind of hard to pull. Uh, man, a lot of amphibian beasts. We kind of whiffed on that. Uh, Giga Giga Giga. Nope. Looks like we didn't get the Mobius, guys. Man. All right, but these should be new cards. Feather of the Phoenix is good. We actually recently got that Nightmare Troubadour. Might put it in my deck. Hino Kagusuchi is interesting and funny. All right, United We Stand is new, sweet. Okay, and Bright Castle. Maybe I should buy more of the Equipments pack. Because, uh, yeah, United We Stand is a blowout card. Uh, let's see what else is new. Got Raijiki, that's pretty good, but it's, I'm pretty sure it's banned in this game. Uh, anything new out of here? Mm, no, okay. Hero Signal. All right, and anything new out of the water pack? I doubt it, because we bought a lot of the water pack, so I doubt there's anything new. Uh, let's see. Let's see, anything new? Nope. That's okay, though. Uh, Hinokagusuchi is new. Yeah, check this card out, guys. Um, yeah. Can't be special summoned, return to its owner's hand in the end phase. Uh, but, if this card inflicts battle damage to your opponent's life points, your opponent must discard all cards in his or her hand during the next draw phase before they draw. Very strong effect if you can manage to get it off. Flame Sword, the Flame Sword of Battle. All right. Burning Land, interesting, good burn card. And Feather of the Phoenix, that's good, that's good. You want anything else? You know what? Let's buy two more, because we can only buy these on the weekend. Let's buy three more. I, I'm, a, I'm a little greedy. Let's try for Mobius again. Let's try again. Wait, what? Why did I buy this pack? I didn't mean to buy that pack. Oh, oh well. We bought it. Did not mean to do that. Let's try again. We'll, we're all, we'll always be going for more DP, so... Ah, we didn't get it. Okay, but we did get Beast Fangs, though, and Armel. Eh, those aren't too good, but... Yeah. Oh, but we did get a new card. Behagon. Behagon. Uh, this... With a large mouth and massive teeth, this is one dangerous and strange sea snake. Yeah, you're telling me. That's a creepy-looking card. And we got... <laughs> and we got one of the funniest water monsters ever made. Boneheimer. Yeah. Yeah, check this out. This monster wanders the sea, sucking dry any creatures it may encounter. <laughs> yeah, I bet it does. That's what she said. All right. <laughs> well, we didn't get the cards we want, but <laughs> nothing else. And nothing else. We were able to end the episode on a hilarious note. Man, one of the funniest water cards ever made. Boneheimer. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even take that card seriously. Okay, guys. And if you're wondering why I'm laughing, um, ask your mom about it. Okay, guys. Uh, <laughs> that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you all for joining me. <laughs> I can't even keep a straight face on the outro. Um, this has been the fun. But, um, yeah, we're going to save here. And we will do some more weekend duels next time, guys. Bye-bye, and have a good day. <laughs> Boneheimer. Boneheimer. It's bonerific. <laughs> oh, man, I'm going to have to cut that out. <laughs> All right. Boneheimer. All right. Uh, man, I'm definitely going to have to cut that last part out. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, uh, but I definitely want to add United We Stand to my deck, definitely. So let's do that. Yeah. Go over to the spells here. Uh, Boneheimer. <laughs> oh man. <laughs>